Last month, for the month of February, I was granted the opportunity to travel to Asia to represent London Language Institute. I'd like to tell you just a little bit about that experience and some of the, the exciting things that I was able to participate in. When I first arrived in China, I traveled to Hangzhou. And in Hangzhou, we now have London Language Institute Hangzhou, China, which is directed by a former student here in Canada, Coco is her English name, Shi Goa Goa. And it was incredibly exciting to see this former student turned director of the school and to see her in this new capacity and to work alongside her to promote London Language Institute in China. I had the opportunity to teach five students and the course that I was teaching this is also very exciting, is the kale preparation course. And of course, we promote kale here at the school, the Canadian assessment, and the course itself was developed by myself uh, with the support of London Language Institute and the assistance of Brian Courtney and some other teachers here within London Language Institute. And to see that take off and be launched in China and to see students from around the world now participating in this preparation course was a very exciting, rewarding experience for me. Of course, while I was in China, I met new people and I ate new food and culturally it was, uh, it was a wonderful experience to see and to experience firsthand how my students live and, and their interactions with one another. While I was in China, I had the opportunity to tutor a young girl. Her name was Annie from Hangzhou and she before I had arrived she had already taken place in a competition for her province in China and she had won first place it was an English competition and I spent uh, several sessions tutoring her and spending time with her and communicating in English and I was given word in my last day in China that she had traveled to Beijing to compete nationally and she had won first place so this was another exciting opportunity and accomplishment um, that I experienced in, in China. One other thing I had the opportunity to do while I was in Hangzhou was do a lecture. My lecture was titled Why Canada and I did this lecture at one of the local libraries and I had parents and youth and teenagers who are considering coming and studying in Canada and dispelling some of the myths and sharing with them some of the amazing things and opportunities that Canada has to offer for international students. And the lecture was a great success. Having visited China and having had the opportunity even for a short time to teach there, I think has allowed me to come back and, and I hope to become a better teacher because I had that opportunity to experience the lives of my students in China and, and I hope to bring that awareness back and to be a more empathetic and understanding teacher in, in the Canadian classroom. Finally, the last thing I experienced in China, I was there for their Spring Festival and I had the opportunity to experience Lunar New Year and I provided a little video for you here so that you can try and fully appreciate what that experience was like, of course. It was a beautiful time and the emphasis here is on family during their New Year holiday. Well, I, I think my video speaks for itself. After leaving China, I traveled to South Korea where I had the opportunity to visit agents that send students to London Language Institute and to assist them in the process and to provide them with 
um, more opportunities and materials to really promote the amazing school that London Language is and the amazing city of London. While I was in Korea, I had the opportunity of participating in the Full Moon Festival, the first Full Moon Festival, and so I was able to do some traditional activities, again, just broadening my cultural awareness, but what was incredibly exciting was having the opportunity to visit former students, to spend time with them in their home, and this was a real, a real amazing experience for me. So what I would like to say about this opportunity is thank you to London Language Institute, to Justin Wismer, to Paula Medina, to Coco for providing me, for trusting me and providing me with this opportunity to travel internationally and to represent London Language Institute. It was a wonderful opportunity, so thank you.